To meet this challenge, DARPA initiated a program in 2010 to demonstrate a four-person vertical takeoff and landing, or VTOL, flyable, roadable vehicle to provide the warfighter terrain-independent mobility. The Lockheed Martin team, which includes Piasecki Aircraft Corporation, has taken that concept a step further to produce a multi-mode autonomous VTOL delivery system called ARIES. The flight module is a fully self-contained VTOL unmanned aerial system with its own power system, fuel, digital flight controls, plus UAS command and control interfaces. The twin tilting ducted fans are designed to provide efficient vertical takeoff and landing with rapid conversion to high-speed cruise flight. The closed ducts help protect ground personnel from the rotating props. Ares VTOL flight module could adapt to multiple missions with interchangeable payloads, offering new capabilities and enabling new operational concepts. The ducted fan design enables a landing zone half the size of a typical helicopter with a similar payload. Using simple intuitive control interfaces such as military smartphones or ruggedized tablet computers, soldiers could program missions in the field in real time. Advanced sensors and digital flight control systems could allow this next generation of VTOL UAS to autonomously identify landing zones, avoid obstacles, and complete landings all without needing inputs from a remote pilot. A full-scale flight demonstrator is in development now to validate the flight module's ability to perform vertical takeoffs, hover, make smooth transitions between hover and forward flight, and meet predicted flight performance. After the prototype proves that it can fly as predicted, additional tests with a variety of payload types may be performed. Ares has the potential to dramatically change the way troops are transported and resupplied in rugged, austere terrain. Together, we are transforming the next generation of delivery systems to more efficiently support the warfighter in the field.